Tales, um, I wanted to show you how I tag my butterflies during tagging season. So I have, um, Monarch Watch always sends you a nice uh, bookmark, and then they send you your tagging data sheet where you do your tag number, the date, if you had a male or a female, if it was wild caught or reared at home, mine are all reared at home, and then where you actually released your butterfly from. And then they send you as many tags as you want. I ordered 100, you can order as little as 25, and so, and they're quite cheap, so um, I always tend to order on more just in case I have a, a good crop of butterflies because you can always use your extra tags for wing repair um, or anything like that. You can't use your tags um, the following season. You always have to order new tags every season, but you can use them for other things. So what I do before I get my butterfly out is I hook a tag right on a pin, um, a pen or a toothpick so I have it ready. They're quite sticky so I always put it on something first. So I have it ready to go. Okay, so here's my butterfly. Um, you want to put the tag on this, the biggest cell on their wing, right there. Um, it, it looks like a mitten, and so that's how you can tell which cell you need to put it on, and I put it right smack in the middle of that. Now you always have to um, write down the sex of your butterfly. We'll see if we can do this without flying away here. This is a female because she doesn't have, she has wider lines on her wing and the males have the, the little dots on their hind wing so this is a girl. So we're going to take our tag that we have ready, and we're just going to place it right there on her. Oops, sorry. Sorry, baby. On that cell. And then I just hold it for about 30 seconds just to make sure it gets nice and attached. It's so neat to think that this butterfly that I'm holding <laughs> could make it all the way to Mexico. It's just fascinates me. And there it is. Our tag. Say bye. <laughs> Let's see. Yep, this is a male. And you can tell by the, um, the dark spots there on the hind wing. And we're gonna just do what we just did. Here's my tag, and I'm going to place it right on that cell there on the wing, right in the middle. I'm going to hold it there. I know, sweetie, I'm almost done. <laughs> it's going to be a nice sunny day today, so it'll be a great day to release these guys. So I'm pretty proud of this. This is something that I got last, or this spring, um, from last tagging season 2016. I had a monarch that made it all the way to El Rosario, Mexico, and from here, from Makoka to Iowa, and it traveled 2,050 miles. So I'm pretty proud of this. I'm hoping to have another one this year. Um, so it's worth tagging your butterflies, because this is pretty cool when you get one of these. If you... Um, want any more information about raising butterflies, you can go to thecaterpillarchronicles.com or our Facebook page, The Caterpillar Chronicles, or the YouTube channel, The Caterpillar Chronicles. Happy tagging! <laughs>